morning. Welcome back to our channel. Today's vlog is going to be a day in the life, but this video is in collaboration with Abby from Rooted and Resk and Jessica at the Waldock Way. In their show and tell series this month, they are sharing their summer routines, homeschool routines. So I thought it would be fun just to give you a little peek into a day in the life here in the month of June, our kind of summer living. So that is what we have today. So Adelaide here, what do we got going on? We got to, um, we have to go to Costco. We have to go to Costco. We have, we have uh, birthday parties this week. And so we got to go to Costco today. We got our regular morning routine. Uh, I think I'm gonna give you a little peek into um, our garden because I don't think I've shown you that. Oh, we'll give you a little chicken update because they're getting big. So really we're gonna good. we're gonna go ahead and get started on our morning routines. I am actually gonna hop in the shower because I've had a couple days of really uh, tough workouts, and so typically I won't have to wash my hair, um, but it is due. Ew, so. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get started on our day. Hey, can you say hi? Say hi. Can you say hi? Okay. Say hi. <laughs> hi. Ellen, are you ready to try out the puddle? It's a video. It's a video. Hi. Mm. <laughs> you gonna say hi in every every clip? Hi. Hi. Every morning we come out here and it's part of our morning routine in the backyard. In the backyard we um, have our chickens in their little house and we have to give them their feed and their water and we go put them in the like the cage back there. We'll show you that too. So they live in here. You love it. They're right in there. Do you want to grab Fasty? Sure. Grab her and then give her to me. Give her to me. This is Fasty. It's one of our favorite chickens. Here she goes. And this is Blondie. The fattest of all of them. Come here, girl. Let's go watch your poop. gonna rain probably in the next half an hour or so what you doing so the kids are just getting some playtime in before it rains so this is our back garden bed here which I only had I think I planted my zucchini like a week ago and I've only had one and there was four here so that is it and there's so I might end up having to buy some starts from the farmer down the road. I need to thin these out, yellow squash, and then watermelon and pumpkin. 
Um, and then I'm sure they'll just kind of like take over this whole area. So. Hey, careful. Oh, I think that's the rain. Do you guys feel raindrops? Hmm. It's coming, I think. My bag of potty mix that I have not finished my indoor pots. This is my perennial like butterfly garden here. Love that one. It's so pretty. It's definitely going to rain. And then over here, uh, I planted my herbs. This is my first year doing all this. This is all new. And this is our... So we had a perennial garden here that we tore out. And we put in this garden. It is starting to rain. So I have been dealing with... First I thought it was chipmunks. And... To not drown out this whole long story, it ended up being earwigs. I had an infestation of earwigs. I just found this out like three days ago. So, um, the tomatoes ended up doing good. I think they were just well established. Here I am on my bare feet. Um, but because it's going to rain, I'm not going to do anything. But pretty much my flower garden bed, I don't know what's going to happen because nothing came up. And I've planted it twice. Uh, and I didn't find out it was earwigs until I stayed up late Friday night, which was a couple days ago, and took a flashlight out here, and there was literally earwigs eating everything. It was so depressing and sad after all this hard work putting this in, because um, this is my pole beans, so I will have to replant like some of them. They just got eaten, eaten to the pits, as you can see, from the earwigs. Um, and then these were bush beans. Um, like this one's completely just demolished, so I'm gonna have to replant that and uh, All of these you can see they got really hurt. They didn't touch the snap piece. I don't know why and then my marigolds never came up So I'm not sure This is actually full of earwigs. You just can't tell so because it's gonna rain um, I'm actually gonna pop those two traps out They were earwig traps that I looked up online I'm gonna pop them out and um, I'm going to try and replant broccoli because the broccoli kept getting eaten every day. And I just didn't know what was eating it, like I said, till I stayed up late one night and found out. So we got, these are cherry tomatoes. Um, and then the rest of these are peppers. And I had planted cucumbers here. And I had planted cucumbers here, but they were completely eaten up by what I thought was chipmunks and then slugs, but ended up being earwigs. I literally had an infestation of earwigs. If you've ever heard of that, it's just crazy. So I have to replant. I was waiting until after today because it's already starting to rain, um, as you can see. So probably tomorrow I'm gonna replant all my cucumbers. It's not too late. And then I have some onions over here, two more cherry tomatoes, um, and then some peppers. So I'm gonna go in before I get soaking wet. <laughs> so, yep, <laughs> that's my husband. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so these look good. Um, but yeah, you can see they were being eaten too. So, anyways, all right guys, it's raining. We gotta get, all right, cause it's. We're gonna take shelter in the playhouse. Okay. Yeah, of course. My All right. Have a little little rain around. play. I know, it's starting to rain. We gotta get inside. That's how we gain our boots and umbrellas. Fun stuff. All right, so I just got here at Costco with the Girls, we kind of had a slow morning. It is a downpour today. It is a 100% chance of rain. It's going to rain all day. And so we just were kind of putzing. I had some things to get done. We put uh, chili in the crock pot because this afternoon I have 
some work things to do and then my husband has clients and I mentioned this in another video he broke both of his wrists a few weeks ago so I have to kind of be out there with him with his clients because he can't move around a lot of weight which is horrible um so I had to make sure that something was in the crock pot because he won't be done training until 6 30 tonight we're gonna want to get out and then we're gonna want to eat right yeah so anyways, we are here at Costco because the girls had their birthdays this past weekend and yesterday, and they are the ripe old ages of eight and 10. So their parties are this week and Costco, we, I'm actually getting my regular groceries today. And then I'm also going to make sure we get cakes or order cakes, whatever we need to do for that. Probably will have to come by again to pick them up and then, um, any extra snacks or foods that we're gonna need for for the birthday. So yeah, we're gonna go go do Costco. Maybe get a couple of samples while we're at it. All right, that's a wrap. Got a little bit wet coming in. Oh, get a bit thirsty. Apparently, I have my Bluetooth going. So we're gonna get home. We're gonna get this unpacked and then move along with our day. I just finished some work. I, you know, have some content creation that I do for YouTube and then Instagram. And I also have a pretty, um, pretty large young living community. And so we have a Facebook group and things that I do with that. And so I just spent a little bit of time working on that. And then I had a phone call, um, with a young living customer, just helping her with some questions that she had. And so Sometimes I will get to some content creation and work in the afternoons. Not always, but today was just kind of a rainy day. And so got a lot of in time, inside time. So I'm going to be heading out here in a minute to help my husband. He has a couple clients this afternoon. And so I'll be just popping in and out, helping him. And then we will have dinner. Um, but because of the rainy weather, my daughter's birthday party is tomorrow and i think we you know might have to be inside just because it's colder and so that means we're gonna have to do a little bit of a pickup in the playrooms because they really haven't got the attention mom attention that they've needed the last few saturday cleanups because we've just had a lot going on the last few weeks so I think we're going to have to spend a little time down there uh, tidying things up to mom's bed. So, yep. You want some more cheese? Is that what you want? All right. So yummy, yummy, yummy. Right? So Michael has a scar on his face. No, he got like a scratch. No, under it. Oh. It's been there for months. Okay, Mommy, I'll take a look at that. Let me see, buddy. Let's see. Right there. Oh, there yeah, it's months. a little scratch. That, I think no, I'll... I've noticed that for months. Okay. You'll be okay. So tonight, we're waiting. Daddy is just finishing up his last client. I left them in the gym, and we're going to just dive in and eat dinner. So that crock pot chili, I'm telling you, comes it's in handy best. on these nights. So, yep. It's the best. And then we just like to have some tortilla chips and sometimes a little bit of cheese on top. And then the kids have to have a glass of milk because mommy sometimes makes it a little bit spicy. I may have put too much chili powder in it, I think. I don't know. This last chili powder I bought seems extra potent. And so I've had to, like, adjust all of my recipes that call for chili powder. So... Anyways, we're going to enjoy that, and then we have a little bit of just house freshening to do for the birthday party tomorrow, and we're going to make a batch of chocolate chip cookies, so we'll probably be up a little bit yet tonight, um, and I'll touch base in with you um, later in a little bit. Okay, so we're wrapping up today's vlog. We spent the last um, oh, hour okay. or so, yep, cleaning and getting things just straightened up for birthday parties for the rest of the week. It's going to be fun, but it takes a little bit of effort and work, right? Yeah. <laughs> to get the house prepared. So, 
Yep, got the boys um, in bed. bed, and the girls are getting themselves cleaned up and showered for the rest of the week. So we hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to join us next time. Bye.